All right, what's up, guys? Name's Gary. Had an issue with one of these Walbro carburetors where it needed a minor adjustment um, on a brand new machine. Uh, it was an Echo PB500T leaf blower. Um, nice machine, but crummy carburetor design. Um, the issue is these little holes right here is where your needle valves are. And Walbro in the state of California decided to make them tamper proof, so we as knowledgeable machine owners are not allowed to tamper with these screws. So what you got to do is make yourself a tool because nobody's going to sell it to you. Uh, these are the needle valves. Let me get them in here. Um, out of another carburetor, and they're what they have. They're what they're called is a D-shaped head. Um, after doing some research with a magnifying glass, um, so what you want to do is get yourself. A typical roll pin. I get these in any hardware store. Um, this one happens to be stainless steel, as uh, I believe most of them are like a tensile steel. And what you want to do is take your tweaker screwdriver and just flare out the end a little bit uh, to something similar to this. Let's see if I can get a shot. It's very small, it's about an eighth of an inch. And of course, it's not going to do it. Let's see here if I can turn this a bit. Anyway, it's a roll pin, flare it out. If you're watching this video, you know what to do. Uh, flare out your roll pin a little bit and it grabs these screws on your Walbro carburetor like nobody's business. There it is. Um, I happen to drill an eighth inch hole in a, um, like an old uh, glass tool or something. It was typically all it was was a wooden handle. I drilled the hole, I tapped it in, and uh, there is my Walbro adjustment tool that fits in that hole just nicely. Um, please comment if I can help you in any way. I most certainly will. Thank you and have a great day. Good luck, guys.